As y'all can see, I got another Nike shipment in. Just do it always on the tape. Just so you know if you verify. If you get anything from Nike, you better have that tape on there. If it don't got that tape on there, it ain't a fish. But we're going to see what's inside this box. Y'all like, share, subscribe, stay tuned. We will be there in a minute. I'm about to show y'all what's in here. Y'all see the box. If you don't know, now you gon' know. Yeah. with your boy D Marks to his sneaker locker and today we will uh, thank you black hands be reviewing the new retro 8 n7 I don't know how new it is but it's not mine it's actually a birthday gift for my little brother today I'm gonna let y'all see it he gave me the permission to go ahead and show these off before he get them he even seen them so we will get his reaction to these but today let's jump straight into it so y'all can see what these look like as y'all can see black paper and white paper on the inside let's talk about the shoe all right, suede on that. You got that material for the, you know, you know that woven pattern. I kind of like these. Think they're kind of dope. You know what I'm saying? The bottom, basic, retro eight bottom. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a big fan of the eights, so you know they don't really move me like they should. You know what I'm saying? Like most of my shoes do, because you remember the Lebrons moved. Air for Air Max One moved. Like y'all gotta understand, but. With these being for my little brother, he's a big Jordan fan, so he do love Jordans just as much as I love Iversons or I love Nike, you know, anything else, he like Jordans, so, you know, I'm gonna let y'all see his reaction later. They come with the two shoestrings bag plus the ones that's in it, so that's gray, turquoise, and burgundy. I think that's fire, you know what I'm saying? Let's get this box out of the way. I think that's fire. Let's look at the back of them. You know what I'm saying? They got that basic retro 8 back. They didn't really change anything on them. I think they look like the average retro 8. In my eyes, my perspective, that dark gray, like wolf gray on there, that kind of remind me of the fours, the cool gray fours. Y'all know what I'm talking about? I know what y'all know. Y'all know, know what I'm talking about, right? So the cool gray, that you know, that got that kind of style material on there. I think, I mean, it's a dope shoe. Something to get away with, kind of the fall time. It give you that look. But, not, man, one to ten. Y'all want my opinion? One to ten. Mm, let's go eight and a half. I give him an eight and a half, depending on the outfit, the way you put them together. And I know my little brother got some style, so he's going to probably put something with it to make it look nice. But, yeah, one to ten, I give it an eight and a half. We'll see what he do with it. Make sure y'all y'all know y'all stay tuned for that uh, birthday vlog. I might go hang out with him for his birthday, so we'll definitely vlog it up or something. But, like I said, y'all, like, share, subscribe. Stay tuned, because I'm getting these same N7s, but they're going to be the Air Force Ones. And, you know, that's my flavor. So, I want to see what they look like. I know I seen them online, they kind of look sweet. I think they're like a 10 with this same material on the side. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that. Um, the what the fours, I'm, I'm on them right now. I'm trying to see if I can get lucky. If I get lucky, we're gonna do that review. But like I said, make sure I like, share, subscribe, stay tuned with us. It's your boy, Young D. Marks. And we was here with the N7 Retro 8. And we out. Exclusive, bro. Look at the Kyrie Six. Not my size. Who's bugged, though?